Hey guys, just wanted to show you uh, the tolerance uh, against wind of Trachycarpus fortunae versus uh, Trachycarpus wagneranus, which uh, both of them are very similar palms, similar uh, growing conditions, similar look, um, similar hardiness, but in terms of the frond structure on the two palms, they, they differ uh, somewhat in tolerance against um, weather. So more specifically against wind, heavy wind, uh, snow load, uh, in some respects, um, you know, frost tolerance and stuff like that. So this is a Trichocarpus fortunae and um, the wind's kind of picking up today here in our area. And um, in general, they do handle wind fine, but what you might end up with uh, at the end of the winter season when the winds tend to be higher uh, is some fronds that look kind of messy so you can see how the fronds at the tips they tend to droop down and uh, even on some of these newer fronds um, near the top here you could see some some of the fronds are not looking that great and that's just because we've had pretty heavy winds here for the last uh, month or so and this palm is quite exposed so it gets pummeled by these uh, winds coming out from the east southeast location well, let me show you uh trichocarpus wagnerianus and uh, this palm is a little more sheltered but um, it is also pummeled by wind from time to time and you'll look you'll see the uh, differences in the fronds so this uh, trichocarpus wagnerianus palm and the first differences you'll see is the fronds are absolutely perfect on it. There's uh, no tips that are bent over on it. Uh, the fronds are looking um, just like nothing's ever happened to them. And it does get hit by wind quite hard here occasionally as well. But you can see the, uh, the fronds are nice and stiff on this uh, type of trachycarpus. So if you're in a windy area or if you get winds in the winter time, um, my advice to you would be to pick a Wagneranus over a regular Fortunae. They're just much more uh, resilient and able to handle wind, snow load. And what I mean by frost tolerance is that um, the thickness of the fronds and the leaflets is actually a little thicker than on a uh, on a Fortunae so they're able to weather frost better than Fortunae. Uh, in both cases both palms would uh, survive but uh, the Fortunae might show damage earlier than a Wagnerianus would. Other than that they're pretty much the same palms. They both grow to similar heights. Uh, Wagnerianus are a bit slower to grow but eventually they catch up and they can get to the same uh, height as the regular Fortunae. Anyways, that's it for now. Hope you guys have a great day.